you ever planned a gift around the packaging? Well, with this little package here, I think I might just do that for maybe teacher gifts this year. Hello, Chris from My Stamp Lady, and I'm here to show you how this packaging came together. I started with one of the um, takeout boxes. It comes in a craft It color. comes flat, and I just folded and put it together quick and easily. So then for the wrap around it or the belly band. I have this piece of paper from the Home for Christmas set and it's a really fun vintage look. This is one side and the other side. It does come in 12 by 12. I cut it so this is 12 inches by three and a half and then this because it doesn't quite make it around I had to cut another little piece that is also three and a half inches by four and a quarter. So the first thing I'm going to do with my fast views, actually I think I'll do this one here. I'm putting just a narrow piece of the fast fuse there and let's just line that up. There we go. This is my this is my kind of cheating way to do it. I don't measure or make sure anything is kind of in the right spot. Just place it. So what I'm doing is I'm centering the top between this extra or the main piece. So I'm going to center that top there and just kind of fold it and fold it over. And then let's come to the bottom and fold it over and fold it over. That's it. That's how I wrapped up this box. So now I need to put some adhesive on the back side here and then I'm just going to wrap that up and close it up and if you notice I did not glue it to the box so it's just kind of a, a band around it so you can slide it off all in one piece and you're ready to go. Then I took a length of the gold baker's twine just gonna put that and let's tie that around it. There we go. Kind of center that. And just tying that to wrap that around. There we go. I'm going to set this aside for a moment while I work on my tag. With the lots of labels, this is my lots of labels die set and I'm using the largest one. I cut out a piece of the craft cardstock. It is the same cardstock that matches the box. I do not want both of the label ends. I want one end to be flat. So I'm just going to line that up and slice off the one end and leave the other one there. Let's punch a hole in the top there. You can see how my tag is coming together. From the Versatile Christmas set I have this Merry Christmas and I'm going to just stamp that on the bottom. And go. then I used the images from the Reason for the Season and the Coordinating Festive Flower Builder Punch to create this poinsettia. I do have a video and I will link to it below and in a card on YouTube showing you how I've put one of these together before. So I've already put this together. Just take a little bit of hot glue on the back side here. There we go. I like using hot glue because it dries or cools quickly and then I don't have to wait for it to dry. Place that right down on there. Let's pull back in that package. I'm just going to take the two pieces, uh, the ends of the twine, and just push that through the back side here. There we go. And now that I have it pulled through, I can just tie a quick, tie the two um, loops into a bow. And then I thought just to add a bit more, you certainly could leave it like this. I took, I'm just going to put that to the side, I took a length of the pom-pom, the real red pom-pom trim and just wrapped that, slid that underneath, just tied it into one knot here and there you go. I did, if you notice, I, I put a piece of gold 
cording trim in that one. In the center of this one I put a rhinestone with this is part of the punch. So I did change that up a little bit. But there you go, and you have a package that's all wrapped. The recipient can just actually slide this entire piece off. They don't have to wreck your work here to open their package. I think I'm definitely going to have to find some gifts that fit into this box rather than finding the gift first because I like this box. If you have any questions about what I've done, don't hesitate to contact me, Chris, at MyStampLady.com. All the supplies are available in my online store at shopwithmystamplady.com. And if you like packages like this, I would love a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.